see myself come up on Twitch. Once I pop up, then I could start talking to the stream. To the stream. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Then I start talking. Once I see myself pop up, get the pop out chat ready. Once it comes up, then I'll start going. The chat is up, now I can see the chat. OBS is working, now I can see myself. Ooh, chica ah, chica ah. But I don't see my stream up yet. Where is my stream? Oh, there I am. Hi, Bugs. Super Beetle here. Hey, Dizzy. I guess I can close this out now. Close out Twitter. I'll still be in the chat, obviously, as always. Let me make it a little bigger so I can see everything everybody's saying. Glad you made it. We're going to wait a little bit. Let some people come in before we start the gaming. Uh, let me tweet it out real quick. Let me tweet it out. Let me uh, let me get all that good stuff so everybody can come in. Oh, there's a ton of people here already. What's up, Elbolt? What's up, Prez? Prez Q? Lion Mask, welcome back. I'm going to retweet it out right now. But like I said uh, on my Twitter before, Monday nights, 8 p.m., here we are. Welcome, everybody. We are doing a clearance rack. We are doing a game that I can find for $10 or less, uh, whether that be on Steam, whether that be in-store, whether that be on the PlayStation Store. And today, I found a rather fun game uh, that I've seen so far that uh, I'm excited about. I found it on the PlayStation Store. Uh, fun fact, I said $10. I said I would not go above $10. I was like, Beetle, you're going to find a game, and it's going to be less than $10. And... I totally found a game that's less than $10. In fact, this game is $4.17 right now on the PlayStation Plus store, I guess, or PlayStation Store with PlayStation Plus. Originally $20 is discounted right now. Tonight we are playing Heart and Slash. Sounds a little, little, little like, oh, okay, what's this? Heart and Slash. It's got a heart, which is good but can also be like some emotional stuff, but it's also got Slash, which is like a blade. Watcha! So, um, I dropped my phone, but like I said, let me tweet this out that we're live right now, and then we can start playing. How are you guys tonight? How was your, how was your Monday, Bugs? Dating Sim and Hack and Slash. We will find out. I'm not sure yet. I'm getting all kinds of updates. Let's see. Boop, 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 boom. I probably should have typed this out before I went live, but I was running a little late because I couldn't figure out how to get the audio to go through to you guys and also have it through coming through on my headphones. So it's not coming through on my headphones. It's just coming out to you guys, and I can hear it a little bit off the off the TV. It was good. Watched the G1 last night. How was the G1? I didn't get to see it. I fell asleep far too early for the G1. Heart and slash. I cannot find the ampersand for the life of me. Heart and slash. Yeah, I definitely need to type this out before I go live now. So now I just feel like I'm wasting time. Twitch, valuable time that you guys have. You guys probably want to go to bed, huh, bugs? Push three slash. Beetle Games Boom And Tweeted Out Now I gotta Facebook it out Just cause I like doing Facebook too Sometimes I have more local fans On Facebook And friends Not a whole ton But some 
All right, let's see. How was your guys' Mondays? Uh, Betty Wallows says, bad, but I hope you had a nice day, Beetle. Oh, I'm sorry. We're going to try to make it a little bit better right now. Uh, sorry you had a bad day, Betty. Hope it gets better. See? Everyone else is already trying to make it better. Not as great as I wanted it. My car's check engine came back on. Had to do a ton of chores, too. That's a bummer. At least you get to watch video games now. Goto and Ishii and Tanahashi and Zack Sabre Jr. and Naito and versus Ibushi were all great. I bet so. The usually, uh... Usually the, the last three or four matches of New Japan are like, pff, fantastic. Uh, can you set it to Twitch automatically sends a tweet? Probably, but I kind of like doing it myself. Makes me, feel, makes me feel like I'm interacting more with you bugs. A, li a little more special. Which is really like all, we, all, all I try to do here is to hang out with you bugs. Because this is, this is fun. So, uh, without further ado, because you're probably getting tired of uh, waiting for me to tweet stuff out because you're already all here. But, fun fact, just a little scoop for everyone that's in the room right now. When we get to 50, I'm gonna be giving away some stuff. I, I can't say what yet. <laughs> Which makes you think, hey, he doesn't really have stuff to give away, but I do. And I'm giving away a bunch of stuff once we hit 50. Uh, clean can be good though, right? I've been doing a lot, at least you feel productive, right? Yeah, a clean house makes you feel super productive. All right. Heart and Slash. I bought this game based off of two things. One, it was $4.17 on the PlayStation Plus store. And two, uh, it had robots. It had robots with swords. So let's get it. Uh, tutorial, straight to play. What do, you, what do you think, Bugs? Tutorial, play, tutorial, play. Uh, let's go play. Let's... Oh, now I don't know if the pink or the white is picking. I think it's the white? I'm gonna go play. I hope I hit pick play. We'll see. But yeah, tweet it out, share it, get all your friends to come follow, because like I said, once we get to 50, we'll be doing a uh, giveaway. And whoever, whoever is the latest follower, obviously gets their little name in the, in the little corner right there. This coffee is cold. Sorry, Kuhn is malfunctioning. Oh, that's a robot name. <laughs> I'm already missing all the words. My TV's so far away. Spoiled brat. Doesn't matter. It was due for redesign. Anyways, shall we start? Please get it right this time. I will. Just a faceless assistant. That's why I read him in a kind of like uh, voice. Up, oh, there's a robot. I think that's a robot. Good. All right, let's see what this robot can do. Hello there, Unit HRT1. I am Doctor S. Dot dot dot. Your maker! Exclamation point. Dot dot dot. Although there were lots of engineers involved, of course. Eh. Oh yes, let's enable the environment awareness unit. Done. Okay, HRT1, I'm obviously hard, right? Try moving the camera around with the right stick. Good, very good. Ooh, let's not get dizzy. Now use your head with R3. Oh, okay, that just goes back to my head that always controls the environmental awareness units. Special, oh, I totally skipped that, sorry. Is there no other coffee maker in the building? Uh, let me go check. Or just let me check. See, I'm terrible at this. Let's get to slashing. I guess it's you and me now, HRT1. Is he gonna try to slash me? Let me enable the spatial displacers. Where was that control? Oh, that's a cool octopus thing. Come on. Finally, okay, let's do this. Ooh, ooh, this robot is fast. Now try moving. Yeah, I'm already doing that. Now I'm jumping. Ooh, double jump. He's talking way too fast. We definitely should have skipped this tutorial. One last thing, if you get in trouble, you can always sprint with... I thought I was already sprinting. Oh, I guess that... Yeah, I guess that's fast. I just have less control over it. 
Now let's give you something else to do. That is a super dope Power Rangers emote. Pick it up. Oh, I missed that. Picking up this. Slicer. Basic tool in a robot's life. Cut and slice, slash your enemies. Sweet. Now I have my slash. Now I'm heart and slash. There's my Y. There's my square. Square, square, Y. Ooh. I am a genius. So am I. Most melee weapons will launch enemies into the air. By pressing and holding triangle in the ground, try it. Cool. Boom. Do air combos. Let's move on. Show me some bad guys. I'm going to slash. So when are you and Razorhawk going to do a stream together? Has Razorhawk gotten his streams working yet? Last I heard his, uh, his computer was overheating. But as soon as he does, me and Razorhawk, Fire Pro Wrestling, I want you to pick up these other weapons. All right, let's pick them up. Fire Slicer. Cool. Put that there. And this one is Volt Slicer. We'll put that there. Two secondary weapons. Equip the left one by holding L2. And the right by holding R2. Easy enough. Each weapon has its own combos and strength. I'm also pretty terrible at like games I jump into, so that's kind of why we're doing this as well. Just so you bugs can see me die over and over and over again. You can always examine your equipment with options. Oh yeah. There we go. Heart, the cheerful robot. See? Called me Heart there. Why can't he just call me Heart? He has to use these letters. I hope you are ready. We are about to enter real combat. It's against an older model, so don't worry. Activating Slash. Oh, this is Slash. I'm Heart. This is Slash. Oh, he looks angry. Can you guys hear okay? Is the audio all good? There we go. Releasing control lock. Oh, bug. Oh, bug. Oh, I got him. Oh, he got me. See, I told you, not great at this. Oh, I'm trying to evade. Hit him with the fire one. Oh, he hit me too. Oh, circle is evading. Second rule of combat. Exploit your enemy's weakness. I don't know what your weakness is. I'm just going to keep trying to hit you. Look at your enemy's face. It shows what he is weak to at that moment. There is no way I'm going to be able to look into this dude's face this whole time. He was way too fast. Oh, no. He hit me again. I'm going to die in the tutorial level. I already know it. Yep. Yep. Oh, I'm dying in the tutorial going to be a constant running theme here on Super Beetle, ga Super Beetle Games. Dying in the tutorial levels. Oh, oh, oh. Third rule of combat. Give me the third rule. Oh, what's happening? Eh? What's this? All good on my end. Good here. Cool. Awesome. This new mic's really helping. When I was doing streams with just the headset, it didn't sound so great when I had to export it. Quality assurance system. Quasi? What about it? It's rebelled. Oh? Again? I get it. It's a game's joke. It's a developer's joke. It's brainwashed. This is just a lot of story stuff. We're really just going to slash stuff. We're just going to heart and slash stuff when we get into it. Robolution. Kind of like Mega Man. In fact, this sounds exactly like Mega Man. You piece of junk. 
Oh, my slash now? Oh no, I'm still hurt, I think. Am I still, yeah, he's still attacking me. Oh! Oh! Warning, low heart. I told you. Gonna lose the tutorial. Roll through. Get him. Oh! Lost the tutorial. Happened right there. So the revolution got started. Humankind fought hard and gave it all it got. But ultimately, they couldn't overcome Quasi's precision. I also heard this game is permadeath, so we might not get past this part. We'll see right now. Let's see. Thanks for retweeting it out, everybody. Fantastic. Love it. Oops. Almost opened my uh, tip. You know there's an evade button, don't you? I was doing evade. It's definitely pressing evade a lot. Just wasn't happened. Razorhawks here, everybody. So if you want to ask when we're going to stream together, Razorhawk, how is your computer doing? Ooh, look, it's putting me together again. It's building me. It's building me a new body. Greetings, Razorhawk. For everyone that doesn't know, Razorhawk from Chikara, part of Cyberhawks 2000. Oh, I don't get to do the tutorial again. I'm just in this... Oh, and I have no swords or anything. Alright, this will be interesting because I lost all three of those swords. And this is a dark game. I'm going to have to turn it up. Kinetic Replicator. A replicator. Latest technology and magnetic fields use your speed to push enemies away. Huh. That sounds like something I need. I'm definitely going to turn this game up. So if you guys can barely see it... Uh, good because I'm going to turn it up but if you can't see it sorry because or if you can see it and it's gonna, just going to be brighter my computer is decent thank you very much cool is it is, are you streaming yet is it is it up is it overheating my, last time I saw that's what the uh, that's what it was uh, control options no not controls audio oh there's no option to make this brighter alright we'll do it this way then we'll do it your way that slicer in the middle. Now I'm just equipped and stuff. I don't know. I don't know what any of this does. I have no idea what we're doing here. Tried to hit the computer. This computer? The one on fire? Well, that worked. Turn the lights on a little bit. Although it's the latest technology in iBook G3, it still is a bit slow for my taste. I did have a successful stream trial the other night. Ah, I can't even talk right now. The other night. That's awesome. I, I'm like super excited for us to actually play uh, uh, Fire Pro together or some other ROM that we can find that can play on Wi Fi. Play Clock Tower on Super Nintendo. It was very scary, but the stream held together. You'll be up to N64 in no time, trust me. Alright, let's go find some. Or is this where we came from? Pretty sure that's where we came from. Is that thing around me? Is that the kinetic repeller? Let's go this way. Is this where we came from? Nope, new room. And it's got lights. Sweet. Are these bad? Oh, I think those are bad. Boom. Got something. Whoa, something in the air. Now we're getting it. Boom skis. Oh, come on, get them. There we go. Boom skis. I don't know how I'm going to be able to look at their faces, but we're going to make this work. Oh, no, I can't even get on top of it. Oh, no. One of my hearts is gone. Oh, and he's still up. I don't have any other, any other weapons either. Combo! Oh, he's just not dying. So I'm going to have to hit people a whole heck of a lot. That'd be awesome. I'm glad it's actually viable now. Should I hit this thing? Is this thing going to explode? Oh, okay. So don't, don't stand next to things when they're about to explode. Is that not where I go? Huh. I thought that thing would give me a doorway. 
Maybe this one will give me a doorway. Run away from that so I don't get hurt. Stay right over here. Nope, no doorway there either. Just gonna have to destroy everything in this room then. See if I get a doorway from anything. High voltage. Nope, no doorways anywhere. What about this thing? Nope, that's not even registering me hitting it. You? No? Can't go through you either? Okay, so I definitely turned wrong somewhere. Back! Where could I have had to go? Through here? How do I open these things? Well, there's Wrestle Kingdom 2 for the PS2. That'd be dope. We got on Wrestle Kingdom. I've never played it. When I had a PS2, I was definitely a, a WWE only type of bug. Back in the days, I don't see a thing that I'm supposed to go through. Definitely already failing at this stream. Maybe I should play a little bit before I just jump on randomly. So I gotta go through this? Oh, maybe I have to do that over here? Nope, that's not doing nothing. What about right here? That's not doing nothing either. Huh. Alright, so next time we do this, definitely gonna have uh, the game facts going on. Personally, I enjoyed WCW games more than the N64. Okay, so I had, uh, I got No Mercy for Christmas from Papa Bug. I remember this very vividly. Got No Mercy for Christmas, and Mama Bug made him take it back because it was too violent, had blood in it, uh, which no other game we had at the time had that. Uh, so he took it back, and then I got WCW Mayhem. Now, I didn't watch WCW at the time. So most of my WCW knowledge is from WCW Mayhem on the N64. And I remember a lot of Tony Schiavone going, Gorilla Press! Cool. See, I'm getting hit. I'm losing all the hearts. Boom, boom. Boom skis. Ooh, that guy shot me. What'd you shoot me for? See if I can get that. Oh, I got that little thing, the little repeller. Boom, knocked him down. These robots are tough, and they probably wouldn't be as tough if I had those two swords that I definitely threw away at the beginning. Little breakdancing moves there from my little breakdancing bug. Come on out. Come on out. Get hit. Get hit. Get wrecked, robots! Oh, nope, he's hitting me. I'm getting wrecked. I wish there was like an area move that I can do. I just hit a bunch of them, because that would come in handy right now. This dude is definitely shooting at me, so let's take him out first. Huh. Alright, bouncing him up in the air, definitely the best choice of tactics right here. Mucha Lucha, some movie about wrestling and Kaiju Big Battle. Mucha Lucha, it was one of my favorite shows as a kid. And when I first discovered indie wrestling and I discovered Ricochet, I was like, what? That's a Mucha Lucha thing. Ricochet pulverizing pinball. Like, that show's so dope. Oh, I found something else. Trash can lid. Sometimes best offense can be to hide behind. Ooh, cool. All right. So now I got a shield. Boom. Shields. Dope. So now I just don't have to run away. What inspired you to come up with Razorhawk? Oh, that's for you, Razorhawk. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, that's a big one. Way bigger. Alright, so he definitely, definitely tries to body slam people. Can I hit him up? Nope, can't hit him in the air. Probably the trash can would not work on this guy either. Oh, there we go. Boom, skis. He's gone. Hit this thing until it explodes. I don't know why I'm exploding stuff. But uh, eventually there'll be something there, I bet. Y'all make me feel really old. Betty Wallows, you tell us. You tell us your video games. You tell us your wrestling video game experiences. 
Oh, you can't see. Zoom, 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 zoom. Zoom, 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 make my heart go boom. I'm definitely going backwards. Boom, boom, my supernova girl. All right, this is where I got that one thing. So now I go in here, and I have the trash can lid now. Oh, I can hurt them before they come out. That was perfect. I should have been doing that this whole time. Whew, trash can lid. Oh, it knocked him back, too. Still hurt me, but just knocked him back. Slightly. Really digging the Super Beetle plush in the background there, by the way. It is a uh, pinata, actually, that I ha did not... I got it for my uh, my wrestling birthday, and I did not have the heart to... Uh, to take it out back and, and and give it a couple give it a couple swings. So now I just keep it. It's just my bro in the background there. Uh, I don't have a name for it yet. I also have a uh, a unicorn pinata over in the other corner and a a smaller unicorn pinata with a beetle symbol on it. So it kind of looks like a beetle and the unicorn had a baby. Uh, where am I going now? Am I going down? I think that's dead. Put death down there. It looks like death. Let's not do that. Well, this is where I got it. So this way? Is there a door? No. Is the only way down? Should I try it? I'm gonna try it. No, I wussed out. I'm gonna try it now. Nope, that's definitely death. That way is death. Good thing though, permadeath didn't happen that time. So many pinatas. Do you guys want to see the uh the <laughs> All right, give me one second. Ladybugs and gentlebugs, this is Clarence right here. This is the unicorn pinata. Betty says her first video game was Donald Duck on the Commodore 64. I have never played a Commodore 64. <laughs> Clarence is super adorable. Say hi, Clarence. Hey, everybody. And then I have a smaller version of Clarence. Like I said. This is Baby Clarence and Baby Beetle. I, don't, I haven't come up with names for them all, just Clarence, because that, that one kind of just stuck. There's the baby. And it's got lots of tassels, like I have tassels. Ooh, and it's got the symbol right there, the Beetle symbol. Aw is right. It's adorable. Sorry, okay, back to video games. Let me put this back. Clarence versus Daryl needs to be booked. You have no idea how many times I've wanted to come out to the ring with Clarence. I wanted to come out to the ring with, um, hi Lilith. I wanted to come out to the ring with a, uh, with Beetle, obviously. But then I was like, some bad guy is definitely gonna just rip him to shreds and so if I come with Clarence way too adorable like that reminds people of me obviously some people in wrestling want to punch my face I don't want that Clarence is way too adorable nobody's gonna want to clench, punch Clarence in the face let's bring him out with us if someone were to ever give me a pinata I don't think I could ever bring myself to open it see that's that's where I'm at right now so instead of breaking it open I'm protecting him with my life and he's staying here He's not paying rent, obviously, but he's staying here. My first game was probably on the Game Boy. I think it was... My first Game Boy was a... Uh, hashtag Save Clarence. My first Game Boy was the big, the OG big ones, uh, but mine was the see-through model. So it was like the, the, the pristine newer one of the OG big ones. All right, so this game is definitely, so far, a whole lot of me just getting lost because I feel like we've tried all the... Is there a map? Oh, there's a map. Oh, there's stairs over here, apparently. So let's go through here. Where are these stairs at? They're this way. Stairs. All right, so I'm in the same place where the stairs are. And I don't see... Oh, obviously. Duh, beetle. I got stuck on that wall for a second. Gotta wait for that back... Come back down. Why did I not think of that before? My first game was probably the Game Gear version of Sonic. I had a GBC 
that was see-through. I loved it. Played Ken Griffey Jr. Home Run Derby a billion times. I played. Ooh, I'm falling again. I played. Uh, I got F F1 Racing. Definitely not F Zero. Okay, where does this lead me to? Where does this go? I got F1 Racing on my first Game Boy, and then I got Pokemon uh, very soon after. This definitely isn't stairs. This leads to nowhere. It says there's stairs. Am I supposed to hit this stuff? This game is really confusing. Definitely reminds me of old Mega Man. I had Mega Man on Game Boy too. As well. Mega Man on Game Boy as well. Alright, back to the map. Because those stairs will lead me nowhere. There's an exclamation point that way. So let's go that way. See, already, I've definitely already been in this room, and I've definitely already been near here. So now just new stuff is opening up. This is a box with me on it. Or with a heart on it. So I feel like this should be something? No? Alright, nothing for that box. Kill this computer real quick. We got somewhere. We did it. Shouldn't go on without being stronger. You have to upgrade a weapon. Access the menu using options. Alright, so now we have to upgrade something. Let's do the slicer, obviously. A nimbler blade cuts harder. I don't know what the difference is. Oh, speed, I guess. And power? Let's do power. Can we do speed as well? Nope, don't have enough parts for that. So let's do that one. Then can we go on? Well, that's gonna blow. Let's make this one blow. Alright, now let's see if it likes us. Good. Now ache this and go. There's a long A ahead of you. Baby steps unlocked. How birds and bats. I don't know what that means. But I got a trophy for it. Dope skis. And this door opened, which I was waiting for. If you guys see ever see me running into stuff, I'm definitely just reading your uh your comments. Ooh, what's happening here? Whoa. Nope. That thing's shooting. I gotta get him out. Oh, no. Stop shooting me. You know what game I really liked? So I never had a, a GameCube, but I would go over to friends' houses and play it. Jet Set Radio Future is like the one retro game I want a, a re-release of or a special edition. Because that game was just super fun. You can make your own decals. So it's kind of like a... Like up until then, the only thing I knew like that was Creator Wrestler on the on the WWE games and stuff. And I was just like, you can customize your own thing in this. You can sp your own spray paint. Like the spray paint barely did anything in the game. It like that's how you marked your territory. You have it on Steam. I wish I had it on Steam. I should probably buy it. Is it ten dollars and less? We might play it for this because I have super fond memories with Jet Set Radio Future. I won't let you go through. Go back. I can't. Oh, I'm a duck. Where did I get a duck from? Has that always been there? Why do you keep fighting? Haven't you destroyed enough already? Listen, I don't know what you're talking about. I'm just a duck with a heart on his head. I'm not going to fall for your tricks. So this is definitely uh, some Mega Man and uh, Proto Man happening right now. Whoop. Oh, or Mega Man is zero. Whoop. Low hearts. This guy's gonna, he's gonna kill me again. Wonder. Whoop. Oh, that knocked him down. Yeah, I did it. Used our trash can lid, guys. We're the best around. Nothing's ever gonna bring you down. Also. Let me know. Have I had that duck the whole time? I have no idea. But if this is Proto Man, where's the whistle? <laughs> I hope you play a scary game on here eventually. I played, uh, I played, uh, what did I play? Friday the 13th the other night. That was, that was definitely, uh, I wasn't the best at that, especially at nighttime.
That was like the first night I did this. I played Friday the 13th. Oh, I unlocked Combo Sword and I almost died again. Alright. I think I'm okay, so you get hearts from from destroying bad guys. Gotcha. I missed I missed some kind of exclamation point over here. Friday the 13th on NAS? Uh no on, on PlayStation 4. But fun fact, they have the NES version and he is uh he's all blue. And I was like, alright, this is my guy. If I'm ever Jason, this is I'm gonna be the blue Jason. What is that exclamation point for? There's one over there too. I don't even know if I'm doing well right now. I'm just running around. Hitting stuff. Hitting all this stuff. This room obviously has nothing in it. Fail. I went the wrong way. Let's go over here. I feel like... Was this the place with the gorilla thing that I just saw? Was I just here? Is this where I just was? I feel like it is. Huh. So I'll go through here then. Oh, sorry. Oh, that's a big one. That knocked me back. Oh, okay. He's just going to keep knocking me back. I'm not sure how to beat these. Oh, we can go through here. Go to another one. There's another big one. Why do these guys keep wanting to hurt me? Oh, this is the body slam guy. Although he just tried to punch me, so it's definitely not the body slam guy. Oh, I got him. Okay, I got my trash can lid. Super pop filter, such fly technology. Got this off of Amazon. Thank you very much. This whole setup, actually, uh, of the microphone is on Amazon for like 20 bucks. So it might be 30 bucks. Don't quote me on it. The only thing I can research the price for is the is this video game right now. Oh, what is happening? How do I how do I beat these guys? I definitely want to kill all these guys first. Not kill, just uh, just take out of the picture. Definitely take all the guys up top out. If I've learned anything, take the snipers out first. Oh, nope. That hurt me, that's not good. Give me some more hearts. I need to live! Nope, that didn't give me a heart either. How do I kill the big guys? What do I do? I got a trash can lid, and that's about it. Oh, where it's at, I got one for five dollars. Yeah, it's pretty cool, and it like it just makes everything look obviously more professional. Like you can't really see the mic, so I could have anything right here. Like I could have one of the a little megaphone from like the '90s, one of those little those little mics that you do karaoke into. You would never know. So the pop filter makes it. Oh, I don't know how to kill these guys. He's got a shield. All right, well his shield is down. What if I hit him in the back? Let's try that. Let's try to get him to make his shield go down. Nope, he's trying to hit me. Never mind. So go down, hit them in the back. Me. Oh, it is working. Cool. Figured out how to do it. We did it. We figured it out. Put your shield down so I can beat your butt. Beat you in the butt. Uh, uh, and all your stuff come off. Ooh. I think that almost hit me. Jump over is used. Put your shield down. Oh. Oh, your head flied off. Oh, your butt flied off. Oh, now I'm just hitting him in the shield. Put your shields down, come on. So I can give gives you more hits. Come on, bugs. Oh. Oh, he hit his own friend. Can I get them to fight each other? Because that would be dope. They can just fight each other for me. Whoa! Almost got hit by that one. Bring it up, bring it back down. Nope, bring it down did not work. Bringing it up worked. Bringing it back down, not so much. Dudes are too big. They're hitting each other. Oh, I got one! Rubber shield and planks. Clear! I like that it just keeps going. It's like not like a level thing. Can I equip all that stuff right now? I wonder. Let's see. Steel slicer, cut her. Oh, I equipped the rubber duck. Oh, gotcha. 
Doesn't look like I have anything else. There's no such thing as a PS4. Everyone calm down. Nothing to see here. Oh man, I got Gamecast. My mama can't afford it. If you remember that movie, I love you because uh, Malibu's Most Wanted is amazing. Simple as that. What promotion do you wrestle in, Beetle? I wrestle currently uh, for a couple of promotions, mainly Empire Wrestling Federation out here in Southern California. Uh, I'm going to the desert this weekend out in El Centro, California, which is a lot more east uh, for desert pro wrestling. Oh. He really is zero. Frankie. Oh, I get it, because he's like Frankenstein. Duh. Oh, 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 no. All right, well... That was a good shot. I'll give it to him there. Next run starts with, I don't know what that means. Let's try it again though. Replay. Let's do this. Rebuild me. No, not desert pro wrestling. Desert pro wrestling. And I don't even know what a cock tar is. I don't even know how I would become one in the desert. I do know I'm going out there to face Uday Aklea in his open challenge because everyone else that's uh, he's set out the open challenge to just comes out the day of and was like, boo, and he's been making all excuses that he wasn't ready. So I told him, hey, I'm going to give you like two weeks notice. Go lift your weights, go wash your chonies, and uh, I'll take your open challenge. Ever watch Digimon? All the time. Uh, somebody actually asked me about this on the last stream, I think. Uh, Terriermon is uh, number one, just saying. Big ears and everything. He's adorable. He might be a she. I'm not sure. Oh, is it a different robot? Oh, no. I just don't have the rubber ducky. Terriermon. Absolutely adorable. I haven't watched Digimon, Digimon Try yet, though. Ooh, Fire Slicer is my main one now. That's kind of cool that I get different different stuff every time. Put Steel Slicer right there. Because I got the Fire Slicer. But do I have to start all over again? Or is it just endless? Let's see. Let's see if I get to go right to Frankie or not. Been wanting to watch that actually. Has anyone watched Try? Is Try any good? I know they were playing it at a couple theaters down here recently and I just didn't get a chance to go. Too much wrestling. Too much wrestling going on. You never had too much wrestling. I'm just kidding. Hey, speaking of wrestling, did anyone watch Raw? What was Kurt Angle's announcement? Because I was obviously struggling to get this stream set up. If I can get a Washer Choney's chant at Desert Pro Wrestling happening, I would be so happy. If everyone just looks at Uday and chants, Washer Choney's, ch -ch 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 -ch. fantastic. Clockwork Lens, a relic from an old ancient times. Might be old, but allows you to see things you couldn't otherwise, plus it looks cool. All right, so basically, glasses. Oh, that's kind of cool. Oh, I guess it like changes my, uh, changes my guy. Oh, almost fell into a hole there. Let's not do that. Oh, there's two big ones this time. Yeah, Jason Jordan. Is it really Jason Jordan as Kurt's illegitimate son? Because that's amazing. I have, I'm going to have to look it up right after this because that makes me so happy. It, make, it reminds me of a very old school WWE. And if Shelton Benjamin comes back uh, to... to help them bond, I would be even more excited. Oh, oh, I'm stuck. It's stuck up there. Oh, there we go. Thought it was Chad Gable, right? Maybe it's both American Alpha. This game is way fast. It's hard to hard to play and talk to you bugs at the same time. Note to self, next time, pick slower game. This is just a slicing away though. That blade is dope though. Look at that. That's the fire slicer. Watcha. Bring it on, robos. I don't know why I'm smashing everything. I kind of skipped through that part. Definitely, uh, these guys are definitely bad in some way, shape, or form. And I'm definitely helping, uh, Rick and Morty escape this uh, this evil laboratory that they've created them for themselves because that's that's what I've chalked this story up to. How weird would that be 
that Kurt dated two women in college and they both became American Alpha. That would be amazing. Like, not the women becoming American Alpha, but the kids, like, just finding each other years later in wrestling and, like, hey, we go together pretty well. Let's, uh, let's start a tag team and find our dad. Aww. I'm... Perfect story. I'm, I'm making it happen. If that if it doesn't happen, you know what? That's in my mind. That's what happened. Y'all can make fun of me all you want. I'm gonna go on. I'm gonna go on. Uh, right after we're done with this, I'll go on Fire Pro and download Jason Jordan and Chad Gable, just to play out that story, in Fire Pro Wrestling. And then they have to wrestle at the end for his estate. And then at the end, they decide, you know what? No, let's do a handicap match against Dad, because uh. He's, he started all this. We love each other, but uh, he's the one that uh, made all this pain happen. Huh. Jumped. Oh, oh, I almost got him really starting to creep me out. Oh, I'm sorry. I'll, st I'll stop talking about Kurt Angle being... But if it is, I, like I said, I didn't get the chance to watch Raw. But if it is uh, Jason Jordan being his illegitimate son, I would be very happy. Oh, I'm getting handicapped by all these by all these robos. So what I've gathered about this game, from just jumping in, uh, there are no levels. You just keep going. I would like to think, ooh, I got hit that time. I think that they're randomly, these little dungeons and rooms and stuff are randomly spawned. Because I haven't really found, uh, I mean, the last two times I've died, I haven't really found one that's the same yet. Oh no. There we go, finally got it. I forgot I could double jump for a second. Sorry that took so long. Do, 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 do. Oh, I think I've already been that way. Oh, maybe not. No, everything, nothing's popping up. Everything's dead in here. I've definitely already been this way. Come back down, elevator. Huh. Double jump with my fire sword. I'm kind of glad I died the first time though, because now I got this fire sword. And the first time I just had the steel sword. But now I have a way cooler sword. Uh, where did that door go? Oh, so maybe I have to go in the elevator. Maybe that's all that was up here. Shaboom. Shaboom, ya. Yeah. Let's go through here. Uh, through here. Looks like some place I haven't been yet. Yep, haven't been here. Enemies are spawning. Enemies be a spawning. <laughs> Jump skis. Punch a punch a punch a punch a. Done. Deactivate the timer. What's on a timer? I'm so confused. Oh, your laptop. I was, I was like, I got. I definitely m missed the chat a little bit. Oh, I have to get over there somehow. So let's figure out how to get over there now. This way, and then this way. I'm running through too many rooms, not keeping track of them. And then, ooh. All right, so when I find those, hit them, because they talk to me. Good, now ache this and go. There's a long A ahead of you. He's definitely, definitely missing some letters. Definitely malfunctioning. I think I already got it, though, so. Oh, is this where Frankie pops up? Oh no, this is where the big ones popped up the first time. The body slamming ones. Huh. Oh no! Almost got caught that time. I was stuck floating for a second. Oh, there's three of them. That's not cool. Oh no, the other one's a the other one's a flying one. We're good. We got this because I can roll, roll, roll out of the way. Flame sword. I was watching uh, another streamer the other day. I want to say her name was Slamantha, and 
and she was playing an old Yu Yu Hakusho game for PS2. And I've never played it before, but I absolutely love Yu Yu Hakusho back in the day from when I was watched it. Like, it's one of those things that I'm like, Yu Yu Hakusho's really dope. I don't remember a whole lot about it. I remember it coming on Toonami after Dragon Ball Z. And uh, other than the rose guy with like a thousand eyes and the Yu Yu doing the spirit gun, that's pretty much it. I met Hiei's voice actor. See, like, I don't even remember who Hiei is. I remember Yusuke and Kuwabara. That's it. In terms of, like, names. Whoa. He's big, and he's got more armor than the other one. Let's kill the ones in the air first, because they are deadly. Rocket hammer unlocked. How do I use these things? It keeps telling me I unlock these dope weapons. But I have no idea how to use them. Show me fire sword skills. There you go. Now it's just me and you, buddy. Pick the wrong day to be a bad robot, bug. Although you look like you got a plug on your head. You kind of remind me of Terry Amon, honestly, because you got them big old ears. So I feel really bad doing this. Sorry, Terry bot. Just slicing you to bits. It's the guy with the black and white hair. Okay, see, I remember him. Oop, I wasn't paying attention. I remember him then. He was their other guy in the tournament. He was the guy with a thousand eyes, right? Like all over his body. The, the eyeballs that popped up. DT Killen is following. Sorry if I missed your follow uh, throughout the stream. If anybody else followed. But how's it going, Bug? Good to see ya. Hello, one and all. Hello to you. Uh, there seems to be a repair thing up here somewhere. So as soon as this comes down. I'm, I mean, I'm guessing that that's what that wrench is. I'm hoping that's what it is. Or it's an upgrade thing. That would be cool to get more life bars or something. Oh, it's the rubber duck. We got the duck back, guys. Boom. Chest, please. The duck is back in town. The duck is back in town. Get him. Get him. Did you guys see that Will Smith is going to play the genie? Oh, no. Died. Oh, I went down. Will Smith is going to play the genie. That's pretty cool. Boom. It's always fun to see actors like, uh, like just know the roles that they're just going to let themselves loose in. And you know that Will Smith is just going to be like, you know what? I'm going to honor this, this, uh, oh, no, oh, oh, he's going to get me. I'm going to honor Robin Williams and just give it my all. What? I exploded. You know me from Facebook. What's up, Derek? I do know you from Facebook. Doom, doom. Next time, I'm going to start with a lot more. Replay. Oh, my phone also. A lot of people are on their phones. Last, The first one, I'm really... Oop. Oh, I didn't press it. I didn't press replay. It's the red. Oh, equipment. Steel slicer. That one's kind of cool. Volt slicer. That one's cool. I wish I had that one still. What were like the rocket, the rocket hammer and stuff that it was saying? I want that stuff. I only discovered seven of them, so there's a ton of stuff in here. All these unlocks, the locket. Doom doom. No tutorial this time. Straight to play. Oh wait. There you go. Oh, there's a ton of the characters too. There's six characters. I'm telling you guys. For four dollars, this was not a bad game. Like I said, it's just a it's just a really fast game, so I'm having a hard time keeping up with the chat. How many people are in here too? Let's see. Let's see some viewer list. Oops. Oh, I don't know what I did. Uh, there's a lot of people watching, which is always good. Always fantastic. Uh uh. As I'm being rebuilt again. Because this is like the third time I've died. I told you. It's, it's been barely an hour and I've died three times already. Um, anyways, if, if you guys are watching on the Twitch website. Or maybe on mobile too. Oh, there's the rocket hammer. Found it. If you guys are watching on mobile. Uh, it might be there. I'm not sure. But. Oh, I got just all weapons this time. They're. Uh, sorry. I'm getting distracted now by my weapons. 
you look down in Twitch, I don't know if it's in mobile, but there's all the links and everything. There's the donations page, the Instagram, the Twitter. Most of you follow me on all of it. There's the YouTube page where Adventures of Super Beetle goes up all the time. And these, uh, or Super Beetle Adventures, I apologize, goes up all the time. Goes up every Sunday, mostly. When I'm booked, it hasn't been up the past three weeks because there hasn't been a lot of wrestling the past three weeks. Run! I thought I, thought I had to hit you, and that's how I opened it. Um, but Super Beetle Adventures is fun. Everybody likes that. And then my matches are up there as well. There's a little, there's a little playlist right there that has a bunch of my matches. Ooh, that rocket hammer just goes. All right, I like this one. Oh, it launched me back in the in the way of that. Whew, take the rocket hammer. All right, so I got a rocket hammer, a baseball bat. This is just a regular baseball bat. That's kind of cool. And baby knuckles is what it said. Or just knuckles. Maybe it said brass knuckles. So I'm a punching robot, too. The new one was super fun. Thank you. I felt kind of kind of bad because there wasn't a whole lot of footage. I Before the shows, we have to put the ring up and everything. And uh, it just took a whole lot of time this time to, to set the whole show up. So I didn't get a whole lot of footage of before and before and after the shows. So I was like, oh, what if, what if, what if nobody likes it because there's none of the, that fun setting up stuff. But no, everybody seems pretty good about it. There's some clips of the matches, and those matches should go up on YouTube within the next couple weeks uh, for Empire Wrestling Federation over at youtube.com slash team metal. And like I said, they'll be in that playlist. Definitely have more followers than I got while I streamed a few times. I typically only have one person, a game designer. That's cool. I think I've, I think I've talked to that game designer that you're talking about, the one that does... Uh, the Kaiju Boot Battle game. He was really nice. Oh, don't fall in the hole. Don't fall in the hole. Clockwork. Oh, got my face back. This is my face. Oh, no. Did I recycle it? Oh, it's not my face. Clockwork Springs. Are they, are they springy shoes? Oh, they're higher jumps, I think. I definitely need to start reading these things. Oh, yep, they're shoes. Boom. Nope, didn't work that time. This rocket hammer should be able to take these guys out way quicker. Alright, this is a rocket and a hammer in one. Oh, there's a lot of them. So it definitely looks like no even though I'm dying, the difficulty is staying. Staying where I where I left. Oh no, get out of the way. Roll. Oh that hit me. You know what? Let's just be let's just be a punch buggy. Punch oh no. Oh, never mind. Punch buggy's not working. Fists are not good for this, for these big guys. You want a piece? Let's go. Boom, punch buggy. Unlocked thunder hammer. That sounds dope too. Oh, there you go. See? Way too busy messing with my stuff. The museum. Oh, the museum of ice cream. Yeah, the museum of ice cream was full. Oh, they give you ice cream. Uh, it was like a 15 minute thing, but, but for what it was, it was really fun. They give you all these neat kinds of ice cream. I don't know, that probably the last episode. That's another reason I was, uh, they have unplugged chainsaws. They do. They're just hitting me with, with chainsaws that aren't going. Um, I didn't know if you guys could hear the Museum of Ice Cream. I was talking over it, but it was very loud in there. Um, but they give you all kinds of different ice cream. They give you, like, gummy bears. We had uh, mint chocolate mochi, which was delicious. And then, uh, char what was it? Charcoal activated charcoal activated cookie dough I think it was called and that was probably my absolute favorite part and then uh, there's a swimming pool filled with sprinkles they're fake sprinkles don't worry it's not super gross but it's a yeah it's a swimming pool filled with sprinkles I love mochi I love mochi too mochi is delicious there is a place over here uh, if any of you bugs are ever in the Ontario area or LA area as well there's a revolving sushi bar called Kula, and they have delicious mochi. Whoa, see it starts with a big one, but now I got an ice blade, so ha! Now you freeze! This definitely, I'm get, definitely getting a Mega Man X vibe off of this. Because whenever I beat the penguin in Mega Man X, I just, I just use the ice beam forever after that. Revolving sushi is the best sushi. It is the best sushi. They're like two dollars a uh, a plate. They're two dollars a plate, and they're just they just keep coming. 
you can spend 10 minutes in there you can spend 40 minutes in there either way you go and get you some sushi i'm in the ontario area but the canadian one the canadian one is technically the well more well-known one so you've got a plus on that and it's probably it's probably a bigger city honestly although they don't drop really good stuff like mackerel Ha, that worked. You do remember me? I guess not. Memory module 2 seems faulty. I have a lot to tell you. Follow the signs. Run! Alright, let's go! Do, 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 do. Let's go, Mega Man. I mean, heart, because this game is definitely not Mega Man. I had a Mega Man 64 on an emulator one time. That was pretty cool. See, the problem was, like, back in the day before we had the internet, I didn't know what games were good. And Mama Bug and Papa Bug definitely didn't know what games were good. So we were just buying anything. The only real game that I played that I knew, like, this game is really fun, is Pokemon. Other than that, like, we got a game. I was just, and so we played it. We just played it until the end and had fun with it. I only know the one in the north. Yeah, most people know the one in the north, but there's an Ontario, California, too. Uh, SmackDown comes down here a lot. It, uh, if you ever hear SmackDown's at Citizens Bank Arena, they usually come after, like, L.A. at a Raw show. They'll do SmackDown at Citizens Bank Arena. Uh, they'll do Raw either at Anaheim uh, Convention Center. Not at Convention Center. Sorry. I used to know it as the Arrowhead Pond where the Mighty Ducks were. And now it's the Honda Center. That's what it is. The Honda Center and... Then they'll come straight to the Citizens Bank Arena. You can get all you can eat sushi here for less than twenty dollars, which is great. That sounds delicious. I'm a big sushi fan. Like if I ever come, if I, I travel, when I travel to shows uh, in your bugs' town, definitely just come up to be like, hey, this is the spot for sushi because that's where I'm gonna go, regardless. Oh, we gotta work out the next day. That's fine. Sushi, sushi comes off, just like all the you can work it off, just like all the other foods. Jump skis, jump skis, we need to have a sushi party. Sushi party sounds dangerous and fantastic, and I'm down. I'm so down for a sushi party. I should have had this isolated at the beginning. This is way better. Boom, boom. Hucha, hucha. Boom skis. I think, I actually think I could probably upgrade it now, huh? Let's upgrade the ice blade. Nimbler blade cuts harder. Unleash the secret technique. The heart attacks launch trails of ice. Let's do that. Let's launch trails of ice. Oh, whoa. Love it. Way cooler. All right. Now you bad robots. Come at me, J.J. Abrams. Get it? Bad robot. Good night, Dishonored. Thanks for stopping by, bud. Oh, I went the wrong way back this way. Watch someone play Echo by watching I don't mean gummy sushi. I mean I didn't. Gummy sushi. What is gummy sushi? I've never had gummy sushi. At least I don't think I've had gummy sushi. I'm not great with names of foods, that's for sure. If you put it in front of me, I will probably try it because you gotta be cultured in life. You gotta try everything. Why Why go before you've tried uh, every kind of sushi? Sleep sweet. Aww. I need to head to bed. Bye Betty Wallows. Have a good night. Shoot. Shoot. Now I'm just running in the exact same place as you already saw. Actually, there's one. I missed a door over here. I missed a door. There we go. Oh. This one's going to tell me, hey, you need some help. Take this. That's dope, Dizzy. You have a lot of stuff by your house. Um, I'm from Azul City, uh, but I've been lots of other places. Azul City being in Brazil. Super Beetle? Definitely Super Beetle. Uh, when, 
we used to go to this I don't know if you have it in around the country but there's a place called Coco's and uh, they would always I mean it happens at every place any diner you go to it's hey super salad and yes as a child I thought you said super salad I was talking about my rock shirt that I've had since 1999 the other day that's because I was a tubby little kid I was a tubby little bug when I was little so much so that uh, I had a ooh, thunder hammer yes please oh look at that boom that's dope using that a lot now um, I was a tubby little kid so so I had a Neopets account because everybody had Neopets accounts when we were little Neopets was awesome and if you say differently um, we're probably gonna play Neopets on the stream just to mess around and uh, annoy you I don't know if I can still find Neopets is it still around shout out Jet Sam and Flow Sam Jet Sam and Flow Sam those were dope um, but anyways my, my name on that was I did not for the life of me and it's weird now that I think about it did not realize how to spell super so I spelt supper beetle my my uh, uh, it's not supper beetle supper boy my my name on Neopets was supper boy instead of super boy which I really like because I was a big Connor Kent fan and I had read super boy comics but for some reason I spelt it as super boy supper boy because I oh I, I can't throw him down dope I spelled it as supper boy because I was clueless Boom! Get in the hole! Get in there! Oh, I almost got him! Huh. Come on, lightning hammer! Or thunder hammer? You're Thor's hammer. Like, let's not, let's not beat around the bush. You're Mjolnir. Come on, Mjolnir. Boom! Clear! Leonidas them. This! is Beetleberg! Boom! Kick. I would kick, but the computer's right there and it would just... Pfft, there's nothing behind it. It would just fall. That would be bad. Boom! 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 Who in the chat has a PS4? Does anybody in the chat have me on PS4? I was a guitar, I got a 66, I get my account. To an exes sister, I think it's a lot now. A, a lot of people in Neopets that I remember giving accounts away, and I was like, "How do these people have so much gold?" Oh, it's because they do this all day, and they just give their accounts away. Neopets was so good. It's ridiculous, though. Seriously, though, how do you eat with the mask on? I have different ways. Uh, most of which you don't want to see, probably. They they're a little gross. No, I will add you on my PS4. At Real Super Beetle on PS4. At Real Super Beetle on Instagram. At Real Super Beetle on Twitter. That's pretty much everywhere. It's branding. It's just, it's just so people can find me anywhere I'm at. So what's the story of this game, Beetle? Are we looking for something or someone? I have no idea at this point. Uh, pretty much, what I'm getting is very Mega Man vibes, because I am basically Mega Man. That is zero. And a doctor created us both. And this other, ooh, this other system that the doctor created has gone haywire and just turned all these ro evil robots into uh, evil robots. And I, this is where I keep dying at this guy. Oh. Boom. Yep, see, they're dead again. Uh, but there's permadeath. Trying to stop the revolution. See, you bugs got the, you bugs got the story. Far better than I did. All heartbroken. That makes me really sad. Or Cloud. Look at that blade. He does have gigantic blades. How comfy is that mask? I mean, it has to be comfy, right? Like, I wrestle in it all the time. I stream in it with all you bugs. So, like, Migates Mitter Man. Kind of like that. It's a big word. I don't even know how to say that. Um, but no, the mask is comfy. It has to be comfy, obviously. Uh, it's, it's pretty much my, my second face. Or I guess you could say my first face, because it's the first thing you bug see, obviously. It's it's there. Um, the tassels are cool. They get my they kinda make my neck sweaty sometimes. They get in the way when I'm wrestling sometimes, kinda in my eyes. Like gloop. Um, Razorhawk's mask looks pretty dope. I don't know if you bugs have seen it. He's probably still here in the chat somewhere. Unless he went to bed like everybody else. But his mask, like, totally looks breathable and everything. This thing, not so much. I uh when I was designing it, I was like, it would be really cool to have fabric on top of fabric on top of fabric right where my mouth is, right where I have to breathe. Oh, Razorhawk's still in here. 
Totally wasn't being flattering or anything. Hey, bug. Super excited. <laughs> if you haven't seen, go check Razorhawk's Twitter and Instagram. He made this little, uh, this little video of me just shouting him out, and then it does the little little friends music, and it's l my favorite thing uh, today. My favorite thing in the last couple hours. So, heartsies, I'll be there for you too. Checking the tweets and stuff. Shout out to everybody. So yeah, who has a PS4 in here? Sorry, I was I got distracted. Um. Obviously, it's on the lag. Oh, you can do a heart in the, in the chat. I didn't know that. Is it is it less than hashtag or is it less than three? Dishonored has a PS4. Obviously, he's been talking about. It. He's gonna add me right now. Black Magic Blacksmith has a PS4. All right, if you have a PS4, here, let's do this. Mega Terminator Man, but yes, Macho Beetle is tracked by Razor Rock. <laughs> Now I got it. Now I understand. Okay. If you have a PS4 in the chat, I'm going to need you to... I'm going to give you 10 seconds. I'm going to count down. And then I'm going to pause because obviously there's a lag. Put a number 1 through 10 in the chat. We're going to try something. Obviously, I don't know how to do this. This is my first time. Um, but put a number 1 through 10. Go ahead. I'm going to count down. Uh, I'll close my eyes. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5... Four, three, two, one, and zero. Are there numbers? Do you bug foot numbers? I see a four, and I see a seven, and I see an eight. And I hope that Cynical Devil has a PS4 because you did just win a copy of. Heart and Slash, because that's what we're going to do on Clarence Rack. It's less than $10. It's less than $10. So, uh, obviously, I'm going to hit you up on PlayStation 4. If you have a PlayStation 4, please say you do, because if you don't, the rest of that was just for naught. And I'm going to have to figure out some other way to do this. Trust me, it's going to be a lot more, a lot easier in the future. But I'm going to give away uh, tons of games. Obviously, what we're... I keep saying obviously, and it's not obvious because I'm telling you right now. Yes, you did. You won a copy of Heart and Slash. So if you don't know the story, now you can figure it out just like we're doing right now somehow. I don't know. Probably. It's it's really dark right now. Oh, no. You, you bugs can see it. It's dark on my screen. It's not so dark on your screen. But, yeah. Uh, hit me up on PlayStation 4 at Real Super Beetle. Or, sorry, just hit me up on Twitch, because uh, that's going to be easier, because you'll probably have the same name on both of them. Oh, I have something, a boxing, so, oh, boxing gloves. I could be a punch -a bug again. punch -a bug Yes, I will die so many times. I, I already have, trust me. <laughs> once, once you stop dying and you get good at it, you come back and tell me how to be good at it. But see, that's just one of the things we're giving away. Like I said, once we hit 50 followers... We're going to give them away a ton of stuff. I don't know if you bugs have any yet. Hint, hint. Uh, Super Beetle uh, shirts. Uh, hint, hint. Uh, Super Beetle masks. Super Beetle making me feel like he's Strong Bad. I love Strong Bad. Oh, look. See, people already send me friend requests. But yeah, Cynical Devil, hit me up on Twitter. Because I know you're on Twitter. I've seen you on my Twitter. Or Twitch, either way. And I'll get that. I'll get the code to you. Uh, that way I know it's you. Because I don't really know your PlayStation name. So if that was you, I would have no idea. And I'm just like, oh, I'm giving this game to someone random. But yeah, I'll get you a digital code. Masks so we can't breathe. No, no, no. The, <laughs> the masks that, uh, that I sell at shows... For all you bugs, trust me, are far more breathable than this mask. So if you put that mask on and think, oh gosh, this is this is a lot, I might have to take this off, just know that that's me every day times 10. Because I tried to make them comfortable at least. They're definitely a little a little more comfortable than, than this one. But, like I said, this one has to be comfortable anyways, because I have to wrestle in it. And uh, entertain everybody in it. But most times, just know that I am i am usually like, uh, 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 breathing really hard. It's me, Dishonored Dowd. 
see now you're just showing everybody it's gonna pop up if you type stuff it's gonna pop up oh this is the guy that I die to every time you're dying for your art beetle it's okay very true absolutely true I want to wear a beetle mask but I don't think I'm allowed to wear it at kaiju <laughs> I uh I have to figure out a way to sell them online to you bugs so that you can uh you can actually get them because right now they're only available at shows and I I have a limited supply right now uh, so I have to go back to get more made and I have to figure out a way so that when you bugs order them online I can get them a little faster made than I'm currently getting them made because so far they're not going very fast or they're not uh, being made very fast and they're going oh see so slash really hard robot to beat apparently Oh, we can. I'm. I can try PayPal. It's just I'm trying to find a little more. Uh, I guess the production of the masks, a, a way to speed that up. Besides, besides traveling as far as I travel to get them, traveling back, and not knowing how many I need and everything. So I, I'll probably do. The, what I'll probably do the next time when I order them is kind of like a pre-order on PayPal, and get them done that way, so that I know how many I need for you bugs. I know how many I need to sell at shows, and then I can I can come back and and just send them out as soon as they get here. T-Bugs. Probably with like a little note or anything, because if I just send masks, that's kind of boring. Uh, I need to figure out shipping costs, obviously. Uh, people have that down. I don't. Uh, I don't know if you bugs have ordered a shirt of mine, but it's all pretty much taken care of through Canvas. You order it from Canvas, Canvas ships it to you. I don't get to touch it all until you get it. Which, it's kind of a bummer, because I'd like to like write you a note or something in it, but, but it's easier that way, obviously, with the shipping costs and everything. So I'll figure it out. Trust me. Masks, masks, ma, ma, my masks are being sold online is, is very, very close to happening. So we'll be right there. You'll be able to get your mask, wear it whenever you want. That's such a gruesome death too. It's like you explode limb by limb. Absolutely. Just <laughs> Razor Hawk may know if Closet Champion makes replica masks. Closet Champion is fantastic and the only thing stopping me from getting gear from them is that I am so far away and like it's all shipping costs honestly I'm far away so the money for the suit and the shipping costs for the suit um, I get my mask made down in Los Angeles from a, a lucha maker um, I get my whole my whole suit made down in Los Angeles my whole battle suit from Los Angeles from a lucha gear maker and um, and that's just just a lot easier time wise they do. I'm not sure what they charge, though. Yeah. See, so so the masks I get now, I can keep it very, very, very low cost for us. So if I get, because I can get, I can get more masks like these, but they're gonna they're gonna be up there for an actual replica mask. Where the masks I I can sell are a lot cheaper. Maybe you can move to Philly. Maybe I can. Honestly, I have a I have a uh, a wrestling friend named Tarasso. He just moved to Philadelphia. Jacob Tarasso. And he is now training at Chikara. I don't know if Razor Razor Hawk has probably met him. Uh, I'm I've been trying to hook him up with some cool bugs down there just to uh, just to have somebody to have his back and everything. Kate's work is awesome. Kate's work is fantastic. She is, like I said, closet champion. One day I'll I will get gear from you, closet champion. I absolutely promise. I just have to uh, be able to afford it first. Jake Tarasso. I know that guy. Yeah, Jake Tarasso is fantastic. His last match down here. In California for Empire Wrestling Federation was a tag match with me. Fun fact: uh, If anybody's ever watched that match on YouTube, you can go find it. Super Beetle and Tarasso versus Anthony Idol and and uh, Friar Juan Ramon. It was right before my mask versus hair match. We actually broke the ring, the actual Empire Wrestling Federation ring. Twenty years in the business for this ring. It's the ring that PWG rents. It's the ring that countless Southern California promotions use because Jesse Hernandez, bless his soul, rents it out to these promotions to have a place to wrestle at. They, we broke it. The Tarasso's last, last Empire Wrestling Federation show, the whole thing just snapped in the middle. And if you watch later on in the match, you can kind of see boards sinking down. You can kind of see just lumps in the ring. That's us just this just slamming ourselves on just empty 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 gaps of metal basically because we finished the match we kept going that's going out with a bang for sure it is and shout out uh you said you were at beyond 
with Tarasso a few weeks ago. That I know, I know for a fact because he texted me that he he. That's one of his dreams. He's doing it. He always talked about going to Jakara. We always talked about it together, going to Jakara. And he made it out. He got out of SoCal, went to Chikara, picked up and moved. And I'm so, so happy for him. Like, I cannot be happier. And he'll text me every now and then and tell me how he's doing and tell me how everybody else is doing. Uh, Razor Hawk. There's a, another up-and-coming wrestler, Bobby Constellation. Uh, we talk about him a lot. And we talk about uh, Calypso a lot. Because we're all friends. All you bugs are my friends. And so... Super happy and proud of Tarasso. Like I said, ever since I started training, he's been talking about going to Chikara. And I will see you soon, buddy. We'll be out there together. I'd really enjoy seeing you over there. I'd enjoy seeing you over there, too. We're going to have fun together. Trust me, it's going to happen. I won't let it not happen. I won't end this spectacular, fantastic uh, ride that we're on without going to Chikara. Mike Quackenbush, sir, I'm looking at you. I'm coming. Be ready for me, please. Uh, did he tell you you should come to Chikara and also that Hip Toss Hank is dead? He did not tell me any of that. That's kind of sad. I'm going to hold you to that. Razorhawk, you hold me to that. I'll be there. Cyberhawks versus uh, Team SoCal, King of Trios. Make it happen. I'm just kidding. Probably everybody wants in the King of Trios. I, I'll work my way there. <laughs> I'll be there somehow. Um, but Bugs, that's all for tonight. I got my heart broken many, many times. You were here watching me. That is Heart and Slash on the PS4. I also know it's available on Steam. I don't know how much it is on Steam, but on PS4 it is like four bucks. Go check it out if you liked it. It's definitely Mega Man-esque vibe. Um, and you bugs can find me on Instagram, Twitter, PlayStation, at Real Super Beetle on all of them. Hell, heck, even on Steam at Real Super Beetle. That's me everywhere. FIP, that's another good one. I've heard good things about the promotion, FIP. Um, we're going to do this again. Obviously, every Monday we do Clearance Rack, the $10 or less game that I'm going to buy. And we'll just sit here and play and talk and have fun. Sundays at 12 p.m. to 2 p.m., we do free play. We're going to play anything. We're going to play whatever you bugs. We're going to talk about whatever you bugs want. And we're just going to have fun. Wednesdays, now, this is the last one that we have to do this week because Wednesdays, and we haven't done it yet, this will be our first time this week, is Beatles Comic Box. No video games, just me, just you. In fact, let me, uh, let me get this out of here real quick. Just me, just you, talking about comics. Talking about comic books, uh, the top four or five comics that came out this week. Uh, we'll also talk about... Um, sorry. My mouth's getting a little dry, obviously. <laughs> That's why we're wrapping this up. We're going to talk about video games. We're going to talk about comic books. We're going to talk about we're going to talk about movies, all the D23 announcements that, from this past weekend. We'll talk about all the what we think's going to happen at Comic-Con this next weekend. We'll talk about all that stuff, too. So be here Wednesday night, 10 p.m. Pacific, Pacific Standard Time, two hours later than we started this one. Uh, because just gives me a chance to read all the comic books and everything and gets us all set up a little better just since it's going to be me and you. It's going to be a little bit more planning since I don't have that, <laughs> that leeway to just be like, hey, watch this video game. So, Bugs, thank you so much. I'm going to say goodnight now. Please say goodnight to everyone in the chat. You've been fantastic tonight. There's been a lot of you in here, which was awesome. And, um, yeah, I will see you all on Wednesday or on Twitter and Instagram. Tweet me. Tweet out everything. Uh, and just tell me what you liked, what you didn't like. Uh, thumbs up, thumbs down. This was fun. This was not fun. Uh, hey, do more streams. Hey, uh, go lay down during your streams and just so nobody can see you. Trust me. I take all the criticisms very well, except for the ones that make me cry. I promise I won't show you guys or retweet those. <clears throat> but, yeah. Oh, Cynical Devil. Hit me up on Twitch, please, so I can get you that code for your uh, free copy of Heart and Slash. And like I said, Bugs, uh, we're going to figure out a better way to give away games. Right now, that was just the first thing that popped into my head. So, as always, you are fantastic. I've said it like 20 times. I'm still trying to figure out a way to sign off on all this. So for now, from Super Beetle, good night.